The tale of Francesco Caprio, an American legal luminary and a beacon of compassion, stands out, inviting us to ponder. How does one man's journey from the humble streets of Federal Hill to the grand chambers of justice reshape our understanding of empathy and authority? Welcome to Discernitively. As we unravel this narrative, let's remember that sometimes the most powerful stories are hidden in plain sight, in the daily acts of kindness we often overlook. The Humble Beginnings Caprio was born in the Italian-American neighborhood of Federal Hill, Providence, the second of the three sons of Antonio Caprio, an immigrant from Tieno, Italy, and Filomena Caprio. The beginning of Caprio's story is not unlike many American dreams, rooted in the immigrant experience, colored by struggle and aspiration. His father, a fruit peddler and milkman, alongside his mother, instilled in him a work ethic that would shape his life's trajectory. Did you know? Francesco Caprio won the state title in wrestling in 1953, a testament to his competitive spirit and physical prowess. This early achievement hinted at his future successes. Caprio's journey through Providence Public Schools and his term as a dishwasher and shoe shiner all culminated in his graduation from Central High School and later, Providence College. These experiences, mundane yet monumental, laid the foundation for a man who would not only understand the law, but the people it governed, education and service. Caprio attended night school at the Suffolk University School of Law in Boston. This detail is not just a footnote in his biography, but a pivotal point. It symbolizes the balance between practicality and ambition, illustrating how Caprio juggled the urgencies of life with his long-term goals. As we delve deeper into Caprio's professional milestones, from his election to the Providence City Council, to his judicial appointment, we witness a path marked by persistence and a deep-seated commitment to public service. To the best of my ability, so help me God. <laughs> his unsuccessful run for attorney general in 1970, rather than a setback, served as a catalyst for further civic engagement. The judge and the gentleman. Caprio's approach in the courtroom as seen in Caught in Providence offers a masterclass in empathy. But what drives a man, a judge no less, to choose kindness in an arena often dominated by firmness? It's his belief that the law, while steadfast, should not be lacking in humanity. In a world that seems to be driven by conflict and division, people are yearning for kindness that I find in my courtroom and here in Sharjah, Caprio remarked at the International Government Communication Forum. In a world that seems to be driven by conflict and division, people are yearning for kindness. They find that in my courtroom and they also find it here in Sharjah and in the UAE. Here lies the crux of Caprio's philosophy, a blend of justice and compassion, acknowledging the human element in legal proceedings, a touch of humanity in the courtroom. Imagine a 96-year-old man charged with speeding, not out of recklessness but necessity, taking his son for cancer treatment. I'm 96 years old and I drive slowly and I only drive when I have to. I was going to the blood work for my boy, he's handicapped. How old is your son? 63. Yeah. I wish you all the best. I wish the best for your son and I wish you good health and your case is dismissed. Judge Caprio's decision to dismiss the case and later celebrate Victor's 100th birthday and his son's recovery is more than an act of leniency. It's a testament to Caprio's belief in understanding the context of each case. This approach doesn't undermine the law. It enhances its humanity. Did you know? In 2021, Caprio launched the Philomena Fund, named after his mother, to assist those unable to afford payments for traffic violations. Compassion beyond the bench. Caprio's influence extends beyond the courtroom. 
his establishment of the Antonio Tup. Caprio Scholarship Fund and other scholarships reflects his commitment to opening doors for others, just as they were opened for him. This gesture isn't merely about financial aid. It's about sustaining a cycle of opportunity and empowerment. A legacy beyond law. Caprio's impact is not confined to his legal achievements. His life story, dotted with acts of kindness and understanding, serves as a blueprint for empathy in leadership. It's a narrative that challenges the traditional perceptions of authority, demonstrating that power and compassion can coexist and, in fact, flourish together. A battle with bravery and hope. Pray for me. These words from Caprio, revealing his battle with pancreatic cancer, are not just a call for support, but a reflection of his vulnerability and strength. I would ask each of you in your own way to please pray for me. Strength. Despite his own struggles, his focus remained on spreading a message of empathy and understanding. This message was not confined to the four walls of his courtroom. It reached across oceans, touching lives far and wide. A man of the people, a legacy of kindness. As we reach the peak of Judge Caprio's journey, we're left to ponder the profound impact of a single individual's approach to life and law. Caprio's story isn't just about legal triumphs or televised fame. It's a narrative of how empathy, resilience, and a deep-rooted sense of community can redefine leadership. His legacy, woven through the streets of Providence and the halls of justice, serves as a beacon, guiding us towards a more compassionate and understanding society. The unanswered question. Why does Francesco Caprio's story matter? It matters because it challenges us to re-evaluate our perceptions of authority and justice. It prompts us to consider the power of empathy in leadership and the profound impact it can have on individuals and communities alike. In a world often characterized by division and conflict, Caprio's legacy offers a different narrative, one where compassion and authority are not mutually exclusive, but are instead essential counterparts. Francesco Caprio's life journey, from his humble beginnings in Federal Hill to his compassionate rulings in the courtroom and his brave battle with cancer, is more than a biography. It's a compelling testament to the enduring power of kindness, empathy, and resilience. It reminds us that behind every robe and gavel, there's a story, a human being capable of changing lives, one ruling at a time. Caprio's story isn't just to be read and watched, it's to be remembered and copied, a shining example of how one person's approach to life can leave a permanent mark on the world. How can we apply Judge Caprio's principles of empathy and compassion in our daily lives to positively impact our community? Share your thoughts in the comments below. Discernitively, we'll be waiting for your feedback. Thanks for watching. Please support our channel by liking, subscribing, and reviewing our memberships. Thanks for your continued support. Watch our video about emotional military homecoming moments caught on camera, or the one below about orphan to billionaire how BYD's founder rose to challenge Tesla.